I talked to people that was in the room when Brett Favre went into the Hall of Fame and nobody mentioned about text messages that he sent to that jet masseuse. Mm. Nobody mentioned anything about the addiction that he suffered from. But yeah. yet, T.O., they brought up everything. Can you imagine if T.O. would have had an incident, incidents like Brett Favre off the field? T.O. still, to this day right now, would not be in the Hall of Fame. Yet, they walked right past it like Brett Favre did nothing. That is true. I the, give you that. The problem that I have with this situation, yep. you got to be a sorry mofo mm. to steal from the lowest Mississippi is the poorest state in our country. It is. It's citizens. So if they're the poorest state, Brett Favre is taken from the underserved. You made a hundred plus million dollars in the NFL. This is what we know. Scared when black and brown people do do fraud the government, they do they hell bit. Mm -hmm. You get an EBT card and you get wick and you get stuff like that, boy, they move heaven and earth to try to put you in jail for four hundred little measly dollars. Fact. Now this man done took a million dollars. Yeah. And they sitting around like, well, well, you know, it, it happened and we'll see. And they're gonna get more money and do it all over again. The biggest criminals, the people that steal the most, look like that. But he's been a sleazeball. He's been shady for a very, very long time.